music. You know what I mean? Gotta have some goodies. Gotta have some goodies. Some goodies. Goodies, baby. Here I am comparing the new 90 millimeter intercooler to the OEM 65 millimeter. As you can see, the pure girth of the new one is quite impressive. And um, I actually can't believe how tiny the stock S4B5 intercoolers were. Now these intercoolers specifically are the CX Racing ones. And as you can see, they mimic the OEM ones pretty, pretty well. You know, I have no problems with the quality of build. The welds are, are very nice and everything seems very high quality. They were only $30 more than the eBay cheapest ones I could find, but too, so I highly recommend these. Here we go, CX Racing fitment right here, baby. Mm. All right, so I test fitted it all up, and it looks like we got a little rubby-dub-dub -dub here on the fan. So I took it all back apart, put a little shim in here, only to take it back off again. And I went the extra mile, so here we go. Still close right here, though. The most. Sometimes you just gotta do the most. Oh, oh, oh. The most. The most. The most. The most. The most. The most. Oh, wow. Sometimes you just gotta do the most, boys. The most. And shim it, cause it ain't fin the malls. Take care of your shit. We interrupt this program. What the f are these headphones doing, Shamir? What the f are you doing in here? Um, excuse me. Oh.